Right, welcome to Filebin, everyone. What is, we're going to start with this video by explaining what the hell this is. We're um, starting this with basically splitting it into three parts. What the hell it is and how to get started, um, setting up, and uh, extra information. So what is Filebin? Filebin is a CDN, also known as a content delivery network, also known as an object host, where you can upload objects such as files, links, etc. And you can shorten links, you can do all kinds of things. And we don't give, and we have, we accept almost basically all file types with a certain upload limit. And what our, our, the, we have thousands of upload, there's thousands of uploaders out there and screenshot tools like Iazo, uh, Imgur, you know, whatever it is. And other um, object hosts like oh, oh, oh uh, rate limited dot me bread dot mo safe dot mo all these things. But the advantage between Filebin is is we have a and then there's Palmf as well. But um, Filebin has a list of domains that are used. Like we have about one hundred thirty two domains so far, and we're continuing to expand, and we're kind kind of constantly expanding and removing domains based on latest memes like you know right now net neutrality is being a meme so we have a jeet dash pi dot today uh with wildcard on it and yeah with wildcard like if you use print.sc or guys or whatever for screenshots you upload to a url you you want to have a custom url well with with filebin you can have your own url and we have a list of domains here. We open this up, our our whole list of domains. So we have star dot let's see, we have we have star dot hmm star dot is my club, okay? So we'll go down to so we can have anything we want there. Fortune dot is my dot club. Right, and it, it'll just respond with the home page, which is just basically nothing. So, what is the point of Filebin? Um, the, the point is is that you can upload files to this, which we are in an in-private beta, and you'll get returned a small code, and you can have you can have anything you want here. Am I right? And then you can have the code. And Anything that's not a code, you'll get object not found. But basically, this 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 is an object host with unlimited. Like you can have anything you physically want here. Anything dot anything dot anything dot anything will all OP. Two dots will always work. And th this is amazing because you can there's 132 domains the con the combinations are virtually endless right now and what you can do with it is now you can wildcard do all kinds of things and we're continuing to expand our domain architecture with you know latest memes like I said earlier so how do you get started well first off we use sharex if you want to use this for screenshots and you know, you are all shortening whatever. Get ShareX. ShareX is an amazing screenshot tool you can find at GetShareX.com. And ShareX is amazing because oh, nice. I'm not even streaming, but ShareX is amazing because you can use this for you know all kinds of things. So yeah, get ShareX. You can find it on Steam, on Windows Store, or download straight from here. And you can have custom uploaders and all kinds of things. So um. Basically, to get started is is once you're invited into the beta, which you can contact me right here. This is my profile, and th this usually changes, so you can you you can contact the email down below, or join my streaming Discord on my Twitch, which I'll also drop a link below, and you can contact me if you want an invite to the beta. Once you're in the beta, you can have um, you'll be in this Discord, and you have to be in this Discord to use Filebin. And once you're in the Discord, we hit this button right here. This little link this generates your token and if you're logged into discord it'll want you know it wants to see your username and avatar your email address and know what servers you're in this verifies that you are in the server that you are in the private beta this is because we collect your email due to legal issues and you know we don't want someone uploading CP and you know get have them get away with it and then we have access username and avatar 
no, for basic reasons. We hit authorize, it'll tell me, hey there, Kotori, your file bin token has been generated. It gives you the token right there, and your token will also be delivered to my email. And if I go ahead and check my email down here, um, close this. If I check my email down here, and head down to here, and as you can see, I have an email. Your file bin token has been generated, whatever, blah, blah, blah. So what I'm going to do with this is um, this token right here. This basically lets you access file. But now the thing is about HTML pages, there's a bit of an issue when you're copying directly off of this. So it's recommended that you copy, paste it in here, copy it again. And control C, control V for copying and pasting. So the next thing we will do is, as you can see, this is an alt account. But the next thing we will do is head down to um, ShareX. Like once your token has been generated, that's all you need to get started with uploading. We'll hit destination settings and you can download the how to, you can download the ShareX file generated by me from here. And when you do that, you can head down to custom uploaders way at the bottom. You can just hit, let me remove this right here. Let me just straight up remove it. You can hit import from file. You can find the file that you downloaded, open it up. Uh, you hit this and there's all these things right here. All you need to know is that you can leave everything the way you want it is. This should stay as file. You should head down to the headers tab, hit this paste your token into there hit the update button and then you're good to go you can hit test and if it all works you should get an image code just like that now the next thing you can do is head down to binzi.ratelimited.me right and you can have you can change this thing to anything so let's let's have our image URL be um omar wamo shindeiru which basically is the latest trending meme right now. Oh my, one more Shindeiru, the you know, you are already dead thing. You know, let me just play it up real fast. Oh my, one more Shindeiru. No, why don't we play that up real fast? Oh my, one more Shindeiru. Oh, shoot. Wait, here it is. <laughs> Right, so basically that's that. We can leave this. And uh, yeah, that, that's what this is basically. And um, once we throw in our token right there, we can change the URL to, you know, how we want it. So let's say we want to say our um, 4chan.ismy.club, right? And I add another slash and I say cancer style, right? And when I do this, we should just let it save like that. Now, if you hit print screen, there's a chance that nothing will happen because it'll upload to Imgur. So what you have to do is hit right click the ShareX icon, hit destinations, and change file uploader to custom file uploader, text uploader to custom text uploader, custom image uploader to custom image uploader, and obviously destination type should be that way. The URL shortener is not ready yet. Uh, deleting files and stuff like that will come soon, but currently there is no feature for that as of now. But that is coming soon, yes. And what we're gonna do, is we're gonna take a screenshot we're gonna take it we're gonna paste, paste it in chat and that should that should work just like that right once that works basically in a nutshell you have everything set up and ready to go you you can now just post images now what's the point of screenshots you don't take screenshots well what if we go down here and we wanted to upload this file we can right click upload with sharex and now that file has been uploaded and we can just download it just like that it works on spot so what's next well you have so many combinations of domains you want different ones so what we can do is 
We can head down to ShareX. We can go down to the result URL. And ShareX has some documentation. And give me a second. Right, ShareX. So now I'm back. So ShareX. We, we go to get ShareX. Com here, and they have documentation right here on how you can set up custom uploaders. And what we can do here is um, head down to ShareX. We can do this. We want multiple domains, so we can do HTTP slash. We can do hashtag, I mean, um, not hashtag, dollar sign random, and we want, you know, file.bin.mo, yes, cool, that's one, number two will be, we add this, like, huge bracket thing, we add, um, 4chan dot is my dot club, Cancer style. We add another hashtag right there, and yeah, that's it basically. And once I do this, I should be able to just take a screenshot now. Let's head to Discord, take a screenshot, take this, paste it in chat. One should be 4chan is my club, the other should now be. Oh shoot. Hmm. Yeah, there should be a chance that. Yeah, there we go. There's a chance that. Yeah. Yeah, there's a chance. And also, by the way, there are currently some domains that are down, so uh, do not worry about that. It will be fixed soon. And for example, this one. Yeah, this one's down because. Um stuff is broken but basically that's it really in a nutshell you should be able to um upload now that's how you get it into file and and that's that's how you do it really so yeah any any other share X support you need just ask around in the server you can probably help out with um you can probably go down to the share X server and ask for support there anyway that's it and uh time to close this door now uh, close this, uh, I'll shut this video now, whatever. And uh, that's it. That's how you get started with Filebin. Amazing, amazing service. We've already got over a thousand uploads and a hundred users. So yes, yes, please, please join us now. Thank you very much.